Good morning. Today we're at the Broken Arrow Trail. And what our plan is up here is to follow the Broken Arrow. I think it's the Twin Buttes Trail and then high on the hog back on the Broken Arrow and go to the Chicken Point Overlook. So what I've read this is supposed to be one of the easier hikes but uh, I guess we'll see right now it's pretty cool pretty comfortable and uh, skies are crystal clear let's go here's our first intersection hogwash will go off to the right here Stand broken arrow. And then right after this, twin buttes. And we'll take that way. Definitely get some great views. Put away for today. Yeah, not awake yet. Hopefully not. So this way. Twin Buttes Trail looks like this is a natural wash area. Some more prickly pear. Intersecting with the High on the Hog Trail. So we'll be sticking to the left right here. Alright, we have made it to the junction of High on the Hog and Twin Buttes. And we're going to go on that trail there. Which is about right here. We're going to go down. Down here somewhere. And Chicken Point's down here somewhere. Oh, right here. This is where we're headed, and then we'll backtrack. Okay, reading the sign here. Sounds like this is going to be a little steep. But uh, we'll see. Here's another view from the High on the Hog Trail. Lots of trees, lots of red rock. And a narrow trail. This obviously is a little more of an exposed area. But look at that. Lots of red rock out there.
so that was nice to know <laughs> would have been nice to know before we got on there but anyway we're at the back to the broken arrow trail and then this will be last little leg the chicken point overlook so up to this point we started here broken arrow trailhead came down took the twin buttes just on high on the hog we are right here back to broken arrow about a half mile to chicken point Interesting landscape up here. These rocks are just kind of randomly laying here. I assume they came from up there. Okay, that's where we're heading. Right out to that point. We're on Broken Arrow Trail and we're almost to the Chicken Point Overlook, which is that little pile of rocks right there. Got a nice view here. And the uh, reason why that point is called Chicken Point is because at one time, Jeep tours actually rode out there and rode around that pile of rocks. And uh, at some point, they, the Jeep companies didn't want to take that liability. So they no longer take the Jeeps out there. We're going to be heading out to the Chicken Point Overlook right out there. And uh, interesting to note about this rock formation right here. You see that white line that goes across there? There's a trail called the White Line Trail. And it's common for mountain bikers to go up there right along that line. I don't think I'll be doing that. I'm not sure how the Jeeps would get out there. Made it to Chicken Point. Here's that pile of rocks that Jeeps used to go around, surprisingly, but uh, definitely an incredible view up here. Chicken Point Overlook. Here's our view from the Chicken Point Overlook. Somebody getting a little peace and solitude. Yes. <laughs> Contemplating life. Crystal clear. Just sitting 
here taking in the views. Okay, it's time to head back. Broken Arrow Trail. Going my way? I am. Here's the Broken Arrow and the High on the Hog intersection. So on the way back, we're gonna take Broken Arrow. Yeah, good idea. Yes. That would be me going that way. We're on Broken Arrow Trail. And we ran across this uh, sinkhole. It's called Devil's Dining Room. Similar to Devil's Kitchen we saw the other day. Pretty big sinkhole, but it's also where <clears throat> bats roost. There's a monitor down there. Kind of cool. Okay, back onto the trail. Got about a half mile to go. This looks like a popular area for Jeeps. I got the intersection of where we got onto the uh, Twin Buttes Trail, so probably about two tenths of a mile left. Still a beautiful view. We are right here. The trailhead is right there. Two tenths. I see a sign up there. Yeah, I think that's that hogwash. Well, we're almost back to the trailhead, so this will close out our Broken Arrow to Chicken Point Overlook hike. It's about 3.2 miles. It took us about three hours, but we went pretty slow and spent a lot of time out at the point. But as far as this being an easy trail, I wouldn't say that at all. It might have been easier had we just stayed on Broken Arrow both ways. But uh, glad we went the way we went. That was kind of neat. And apparently we're expert hikers because we did a double black diamond. <laughs> so anyway. By mistake. Keep by that mistake, in mind. By but mistake. You know what? It wasn't that bad. <laughs> no, so, it was not bad at all. All right. So here we are. Great day.